Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Before we get into things, I just want to mention that Fatal Fangs 2 is on its way. Uh, the draw has been made and uh, this is who I got. Next, we have the traitor himself, only because he used to live in my hometown and happened to move away. That's right, it's Gav from Gav's Tarantulas and he is versing the awesome Ian Tarantula. Now, if you don't know Ian Tarantula, guys, he had a cracking Balfouri video that kind of exploded on YouTube. If you haven't seen it, you must. It was amazing. Both very good friends of mine. So I've met Gav a few times. He's a nice guy, a good, good friend of mine. Uh, I am looking forward to this battle in the first fight of things. He had some really good feeding clips. So, uh, yeah, looking forward to seeing what he's got. So make sure you go check out Bug Ram's channel. Uh, all the competition will be on his channel. I will put a link in the description and at the end of the video. So just got a bit of an update on the Yembo Fori baby. So they're doing really, really well. Uh, Mum was out having a drink and uh, all the babies were out. I counted so far 26, but from this video, there did seem a few more. So until I actually take them out, I don't really know how many is in there. But yeah, I'm looking forward to getting up a, a good number on these. So if you want to have a guess, uh, have a guess in the comments down below how many you think are in here. So, uh, obviously with the Fatal Fangs tournament coming up, I thought I'd do a bit of a feeding video. Uh, so I managed to get quite a few clips put together. And whilst I was doing it, I actually thought, well, because I've got my second camera now, uh, my second phone, I can actually do some slow motion feeding clips. So uh, yeah, that's what I thought I'd give it a go. But here are some of the babies. Obviously you don't need slow motion for this one. Uh, they're all piling on the cricket there. Uh, I thought it was a pretty good clip, so I thought I'd uh, share it with you guys. And uh, yeah, they're all doing really, really well. Uh, this is the other communal club. This is uh, 14 juveniles. These are coming up for a rehouse very, very shortly, guys. So if you fancy watching that, then uh, please don't forget to subscribe. Uh, that will probably be my next video I upload. So here is uh, another six that I got. I got these from Phil Dunn from his successful breeding. So I will be adding these in with the babies that I've got as well. Uh, when I go to rehouse these guys in the big communal tank that I've got ready to go so yeah uh, there's going to be probably a couple more months before I actually put them all in there just want to get them a bit of a bigger size so uh, a little update on my H Gigas communal uh, this is some feeding clips that I've got from these guys they are very active when I chuck some crickets in So there's one all five are still accounted for i counted them literally this week so yeah so they're doing really really well uh this one is the biggest one of the five that's uh, so a good little take down there shame it's covered by that leaf but still a good clip regardless And this was another one that I thought was a pretty good clip to get. Coming out of the burrow. Bam. Got him. So yeah, guys, that's my H Gigas communal update. With some feeding clips. That's, uh, let's move on. So this is my Pucklethera Regalis. I had the male in there for a, a long time. She did end up eating him and then she molted out. So yeah, sadly I've got to find another male, but this is a good little take down there. Uh, the glass front was uh, a bit smeary, but then I did manage to get this one a couple of weeks later with a big locust after I cleaned the front as well. So yeah, so you get a bit of a better view and look at those yellows on the bottom of the legs absolutely beautiful she is gorgeous and this is the p metallica this was not long after i removed the mail the camera is struggling to focus because of the light conditions but yeah it was a nice little takedown 
and this is a clip I'm really glad I got. It's hard to get these uh, on video eating, but this is my T Celadonia. I'm only down to one now, guys. Sadly, one passed away. Again, I don't know what I've done wrong with that, but this one seems to be doing really, really well. Uh, this was the first one I got out of the two. And yeah, so it's uh, actually taking a cricket down on video, which is very, very rare for me to get because every time I actually feed it, when it when I'm not recording, it takes it down, but when I'm trying to record it, it never takes it. So yeah, pretty pleased with that one. So I've got the slow motion camera out and uh, this was the first attempt. You can see I didn't really need a slow motion camera for that one. That was a pretty gentle takedown for my Terrapin now, my size my. Grammastola Popcropes. This is a male. I think he's one mole off being mature. Again, didn't really catch much. So we moved on to my Theraphosa Sturmy. Yeah, it's a nice little takedown. Um, with the normal camera, it didn't really get a good view. But we'll see what it's like with the slow motion. Yeah, there we go. Some nice fang action there. Yes, yeah, so that's a little bit better. Next up, my two little cattle, Alba Pelosus, curly hair. Yeah, this one never refuses food. I was trying to drop it literally behind and it tilted just as I dropped it, so didn't get quite the right angle for that one. But I've never used two different angles with filming before, so hopefully the next time I'll try and get you know, better angles and everything. So, but yeah, so a nice little slow motion takedown there. You see, this one's molted recently, and the colours on this one, the deep blacks on the carapace. This is my Acnopama calcodes. This is the new river rust. This is the female. Check that down nicely. Again, I didn't want to drop the super worm so close. I wanted it to be a bit more behind, but again, my aim is a little bit off. But a slow motion over the top. Nonetheless, it's, uh, yeah, not too bad. Next up is my Panthabetus machala. Again, this is a, I think this is a male. But yeah, nice, good little take down there. Yeah, you, know, you can see how quick that was, how quick that turned around, even by that slow motion, it actually turned around pretty fast. Do a rehousing. Uh, this is my chromatopamicide pubescence. Nice little take down there. Let's see the slow motion. Bang action there. So yeah, that's pretty much all I've got with this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, just a quick one there, my Harbactera polcripes. He actually matured into a male, so that was uh, so January 2019 I got him. I sent him off to Fantastic Tarantulas to pair with his female. So thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget Fatal Fangs. Uh, link to Bug Rounds channel is just here. And uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Uh, take care, everybody.